Hey, what's up, guys and gals, boils and ghouls, cats, kittens, daddy o's, and mamas? This is uh, your pal Deluxe Chimp coming to you from uh, Evergreen, Colorado. Out on a ride today, uh, enjoying these uh, beautiful bright blue skies. Sure, the roads might have some uh, wet spots and some scattered gravel, but hey, the sun is shining. It's Saturday, I'm out riding. Well, anyhow, today's topic is gonna be, what do you ride? You know, what's your, what's your brand? Tell me about your bikes. You know, are you a Harley guy? Are you a Honda guy or gal? Uh, you know, Triumph, Royal Enfeld, Moto Guzzi, if you're so inclined. Tell me about your bikes. You know, tell me about that special relationship that you have with your bike. You know, have you named your bike? This Honda that I'm on right now, uh, this is my second Honda. Its name derives uh, from my first Honda, uh, whose name was Kitty. Uh, my wife named her Kitty because she purred like a kitten. Uh, now the Goldwing, uh, we call her K2D2, as in uh, Kitty 2, but the D2 is a reference to R2D2, uh, because the technology on this bike is just so darn futuristic compared to what I'm uh, used to riding. Uh, my other bike, uh, my 1996 Harley Davidson, uh, which was my uncle's bike, uh, that one came to me uh, after she sat for a little while. She sat out in the garage, collected up a lot of garage dust, a little bit of rust and crust. You know, the tires cracked and checked a little bit. So uh, she took a little bit of work to get back on the road again. And uh, my wife named that bike too. And uh, her name is Dirty Girl. Uh, I love that bike to death. I've wrenched on it quite a bit. Uh, got her back on the road, I'm proud to say, uh, and I'm happy to be the custodian, if you will, of that motorcycle. Um, unfortunately, I never got to ride with my uncle when he was still alive, but uh, again, I'm the custodian of his bike. I'm the keeper of his bike, and that bike's always going to be in the family. Uh, someday when I move on from riding, that bike's going to get passed on. It's going to get passed on to, uh, you know, to, uh, you know, the cousin's kids, you know, so they can enjoy it. Anyhow, uh, again, tell me what you're riding. Why did you pick it? You know, was it a, a brand that you've always been interested in? Or did you go out for a test ride and you fell in love with the bike? Uh, Again, for me, for the Honda, uh, this Goldwing, as a matter of fact, uh, this bike was a replacement for a bike that I had, uh, which was a 2016 and a half uh, Dyna uh, Lowrider S, the Screaming Eagle, the big 110. Uh, some folks will say, you know, it was the last of the great Dynas. Uh, never thought I would part with that bike, but unfortunately, uh, I got rear-ended. I got rear-ended uh, while I was driving a truck. Got rear-ended by another truck. And uh, messed my back up quite a bit. So, unfortunately, I wasn't able to ride that bike uh, for very far. And the sad thing about it was that uh, that was a motorcycle that I rode all over the country. Uh, I've been through 15 states, part of Canada. Uh, and I really enjoyed that bike. It was kind of a wicked cool bike. Uh, all blacked out with the gold wheels and like the gold emblems. Uh, that bike was fondly named the Demon. Uh, and it was a demon. It was a screaming demon all right. You know, quick bike for a Harley. Uh, she ran hot. You know, it was one of her quirks, like really hot. Uh, never quite got that one sorted out. But, uh, well, I've since moved on, and I've stepped into this big old Goldwing. You know, this was a, a bike that I purchased, so I could keep riding long distances very comfortably. 
So go ahead and uh, you know leave me a comment down in the comment section. Let me know what you're riding. Uh, let me know why you picked it. And by all means, if you named that bike, what's your bike's name? Anyhow, uh, thanks for watching. Keep an eye out for more content as it becomes available. And until next time, ride safe.